Hello everyone to another week with War Thunder. Not much has gone on this week, so this should be a shorter video. We have the Koi and Gordon week in Japan. We're playing tier 3 battles in Japan that would reward you with a Koi decal. A standard small decal event with a nice decal. This is available until the 5th. In terms of decal events, we also got the Polish Constitution decal event, whereby playing with tier 3 British vehicles or higher, will grant you a I Love Poland decal and is available until the 5th as well. One of the main pieces of news is the weekly It's Fixed post. This week we got automatic transmissions receiving a fix as they could previously get stuck on the first gear while in reverse. It is also now easier to see the weight of loadouts and the potential options in them. Also some missile changes, the AGM-65 is now able to loft and the 9M311 has now double the overload limit. Apart from that, there is not really any bug to mention and overall the list of changes this time around is pretty small. I suppose the most important piece of news for the week would be the mail sale or otherwise regarded as the Victory Day Sale. The in-game sales are going on until the 5th and include a 30% discount for all nations and all vehicles unless it was an addition in one of the last two updates. This includes modifications, talismans and backups, as well as a 50% discount for premium time. There will also be a sale on the store which will start on the 5th and end on the 10th. For an idea of what we could get we could have a look at the last year there they gave a 50% discount to packs which were being removed from the store as well as for starter packs. They also had a sale for some rarer vehicles where buying one of the packs would give you a 5% discount but it would stack up to 60% for all packs if you bought all of them. This is one of the worst sales they have done because unless you are buying absolutely everything you are getting a worse deal. Hopefully they just do a bundle or 50% discount this time. Last year also saw the event for the IS2-321. At this time we're playing an event and getting a certain amount of score which get you this tank as well as some decals and decorations. Would be very curious to see if they do something similar like that this year. The year before that we got an event for some weapon decorations so it seems guaranteed that we will see an event for at least something. We will just have to see if it includes a vehicle reward or not or if it will just be standard decorations. And finally for the last piece of use we have the dev vlogs which are coming up for the end of this week. With the info we have, the dev vlogs will be seen either Thursday or Friday, as this will line up with what has been said on the forums, as well as with past years, so just keep an eye out, as there will be a lot of news coming out in the coming days. But that is about it for now, so thank you for watching.